Hi, I'm Mark Keane. I'm a Microsoft Azure evangelist. I saw a much needed gap in the Azure market and developed a tool completely based on PowerShell to help Azure customers move virtual machines effortlessly from Azure's old ASM Azure Service Management environment to Azure's new ARM Azure Resource Manager environment. Before today, there hasn't really been a tool to fully automate this process, and it's been a totally manual task. It's on Microsoft's roadmap to move away from ASM, and the sooner you move away from it and onto ARM, the better you will be. What is the overall value and business benefits of using an automated Azure Virtual Machine Migration Tool? We all know that all virtual machines in Azure use VHD files. Currently, there's no way of setting up an existing virtual machine from an existing VHD file using the new Azure portal. You need to use PowerShell instead. It's unlike the old service management portal where you could do this. The VM migration tool automates this process of setting up new compute using the existing VHD file. Capturing and recording information about the source virtual machine can be an administration nightmare. The virtual machine migration tool takes the hassle out of capturing the source state and ensures the target will be the exact same virtual machine, same size, same amount of disks, same firewall rules and same network configuration, both virtual network, subnets and DNS addresses. Dealing with the new Azure resource management can also be a nightmare. All new technologies that you would be unfamiliar with choosing between a load balancer and a network security group, or choosing between a front-end IP configuration or a back-end address pool, knowing the new requirements of a virtual network, or understanding the new PIP, when you should use a static PIP versus a dynamic PIP. Rule of thumb when working with this VM migration tool, it's best to keep an existing virtual network intact. In other words, follow an ASM to ARM relationship guidance of a single virtual network with all its VMs to one Azure resource group. With this guidance, the migration tool will ensure the target state will have the same virtual network set up along with all the necessary virtual machines. The tool takes into consideration everything for the source virtual machine, multiple NICs, both OS and data disks, VM extensions, ACL endpoints, load balancer and load balancer rules. What are the benefits and business value of moving VM workloads to ARM? Logically group application workloads in a resource group which comprises of SQL, storage, compute, networks, etc. Logically organize all of the resources in your subscription into groups of resources. Role-based access control. Delegate access to individual resources or entire resource groups to anybody. Repeatedly deploy your solution through the development lifecycle and have confidence your resources are deployed in a consistent state. Parallel deployment using scale sets. Deploy any number of virtual machines in the time it takes you to deploy one virtual machine. More deployment options using JSON templates, PowerShell and the web portal. More flexibility to make changes to resources without having to shut down the virtual machine. Apply tags to resources so that certain resources stand out more easily in billing and much better security and granularity of network endpoint NAT rules, both inbound and outbound. To start using the tool today, please contact mark.keen at ripe.com or inquiries at ripesolutions.com.